Welcome to Denewer, Scotland. Denewer is located in South Ayrshire, Scotland. It is situated along the coast of the Firth of Clyde. Most recently, it's known as a film location for the TV show Outlander. It was the Outlander TV series that attracted our interest in visiting. If it wasn't for the TV series, we probably wouldn't have stopped. One of the main locations used in Outlander was Denewer Harbor. Traditionally, the medieval castle in Denewer is the main attraction. However, Outlander has given a lot of attention to this harbor. And rightfully so, it's a beautiful place. The depth of the harbor is only about 12 feet. So it is ideal mainly for small fishing boats. In the Outlander TV series, Jamie and Claire, Roger and Bree all departed from this harbor to the Americas. This all occurred at different times, but this was a key location in the series. You can see in the previous scene that some small wooden buildings were built towards the back of the harbor. In reality, there's some portable buildings as well as boat storage there. One of the most notable characteristics of the harbor is the cylindrical stone harbor light. You can see it here as well as in the TV series. One of the positives of bringing a TV show like Outlander to Denewer is its ability to bring tourists and money into a small town like this. We would have probably never considered going to this village if Outlander didn't place it on the map. We are so glad it did because it was worth the visit. The New York Castle is one of the most notable reasons to go to this village. The ruins date to the 15th and 16th centuries. In Outlander, the castle represented Silky's Island. Of course, the castle isn't on an island at all. It's right on the coast. So with a little CGI and reversing the image, they made it into an island. The castle fell into complete ruin by 1694. The castle today is safe to visit and is located in Kennedy Park. The castle overlooks the Denewer Labyrinth. It was built in 2008 and even has its own Facebook page. Let's go get a closer look at the castle. Here's a scene from Outlander with Jamie Fraser climbing up to Silky's Island. As we pan over to the left, you'll notice a wide gaping hole in the side of the castle. You can see Jamie Fraser entering that same hole in the scene from Outlander. Notice that the room he walks into matches exactly to this shot that I took here. Not only that, as you look to the right, the greenish colored stone you'll see a hole with pigeon feathers. That's where the silky treasure was located. Unfortunately, I was several centuries too late to find that treasure. Just outside of the area where Jamie Fraser just was are stairs leading up to the top of the castle. At the base of the castle is the keep. It is said that there are secret lay tunnels which connect this castle to the Greenan Castle further north. I didn't do enough exploring to find out if that was true. But here is what I saw from atop the castle. If one would consider a view a treasure, I certainly found it while I was there. There are several paths that take you to some amazing places in Kennedy Park. The views we found here are second to none. Near the castle is a stone structure which was most likely used for pigeons. This view from Dunyer made this trip 100% worth it. The harbor is just on the other side of the beach there. The 
The waterfalls and the trickling stream is all at the base of the castle. My wife and daughter can be seen in the middle strolling along this beautiful beach. We hope you enjoyed this video and I hope that you make Dunyer a stop in your travels in Scotland. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to smash the like button. We also invite you to subscribe to our channel so you can see other videos about Scotland as well as other places around the world. Be sure to click the video on the left to see our Scotland playlist for all of our other videos of Scotland. Thank you.